Hi guys, welcome to Food for Thought, I'm Gordon. Um, I wanted to talk today uh, about something that's really dear to my heart. Free stuff. Um, especially wood. Now, as you see here, I've got a whole pack of stuff. This is, I'm getting prepared obviously for the, the, the spring. Um, I've done a couple of other videos on how to make boxes and whatnot from, from pallets. I'm going to be making gates and etc, etc. Um, so this is all free. Now, sometimes you, you find a, a cache of, um, of wood that's, that you didn't even know it was there. Now, I've, I've, I'm lucky that I've got a company that's close to me. It's literally 30 seconds from my house. Um, we're out in a, in a small village um, in, in here in Ontario. But we've got a small, it's a, a roof truss company um, that obviously make roof trusses for, for houses, etc. Now, I go over there because they, ev every week, or ev almost every day actually, um, they put out a whole pile of different wood, um, o OSB boards and all that sort of stuff. Um, they put this out for basically the community to go and help themselves. Now this help. This is a twofold thing. One, the company, if they don't do that, and they have to pay to get all this stuff uplifted. So, what's the point in doing that and throwing it out to to a garbage pit that's never going to get used? So they put it out. They put um, on skids. They put all different sizes of OSB boards, um, and they also put out offcuts of quite fine um, for people to basically go and grab and it's up to obviously it's up to you then to decide what you're wanting to do it for. Um, previously in the past I was just grabbing it just because I can go and, and chop this up and it's absolutely fantastic for kindling and I would just throw this on the on the, the, the fire pit. What I'm doing with it this time, we were at Edward was over just a few days ago. We decided to, to go across Edward said look there's a pile, a whole pile of stuff so we jumped in the trucks, away we go. Um, and it was fantastic. Something it's a there at the right time um, type type of deal. Um, other people can drive past and it's, they can grab it and you've lost out. We were lucky, we got a good good thing that last time. Um, so basically I've got a whole whack load of OSB. Now this is all uh, three quarter inch OSB board. Um, all, these are all, all different sizes, um, good chunk of, of stuff. I've got a whole board, a five foot board, but it's split down the middle. It's well, the, the spine's broke, um, but I can I can go and get my circle saw and cut these and get two feet wide boards out of it. I also got off cuts like this, um, and it's all they're all cut the exact same size. And I'm gonna make I'm gonna make my planters out. This is my raised bed for, for growing some of my uh, vegetables. And some of the, I mean this is, I mean, you, literally I just bang it into this and you can barely look. And this is just a fraction of the, the wood that they throw out. I mean literally a fraction of the wood. Um, but the, to the, obviously to them, this these are all off cuts. Um, to me, this is like finding gold. Now the beauty of this stuff, that I, I haven't come across this before actually. There was a whole ton of stuff, they're all exactly the same size. Um, so what I've, I've done, you just basically nailed, I've just nailed these together. And this, this literally took three minutes. Um, just butted them up together, nailed, poof, done. So I'll make two of these out of that. Um, I'll, I'm out of the rest of the stuff. I'll probably get easy four of these um, and then go on to do other things. I'm not really sure yet, but. I'm always looking to th make things, um, but it was mainly to, to go on. Um, this all, especially I don't know how, how they are placed in, in America or UK or whatever. Um, didn't really do much of this in the UK, um, but all this stuff is has to get picked up. So as I say, this company puts it out, and then you just help yourself. So have a look in your local area and what companies are actually out there. A lot of people don't even know what companies are actually close that do this sort of stuff. Um, 
good knocking the, the doors. The, usually they'll have some sort of skip um, that is full of, full of stuff. Ask them, look, is that free? Is that going? Because nine times out of ten, they'll, they'll probably let you go through it. Um, but anyway, I just thought, okay, put this forward, get the thinking caps on. What's in your local community? What can you get for, for free that people are throwing out? Um, there used to be an old saying, what's one man's junk is another man's treasure. Well, to me, I've just, I've got treasure. Um, cause to buy all this stuff, I couldn't have, you basically couldn't afford to keep on buying and buying and buying and buying all this sort of stuff. Um, building materials is an absolutely ridiculous price now. Um, so when you get it for free, to me, it's like gold. So this part of the, the, the project that I'm going on this, this year is all recycled stuff get stuff for free and what you can actually do out in your, your garden with it or build stuff in your house or whatever even if it's little cabinets etc etc it's it's really up to what's in your in your mind so get the thinking caps on um, and see what you can get doing okay take care guys